I don't know exactly why. Maybe you can tell me why. Oh, I could definitely I, tell you. He said a lot of wild shit. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> maybe he said a lot of wild shit, maybe and then is. CNN, uh, in their all their brilliance, by highlighting your wild shit, made you much more popular. Yeah. yeah. And they boosted you in the polls because people were tired of someone talking in this bullshit, pre-prepared politician lingo. And even if they didn't agree with you, they at least knew wh whoever that guy is, that's him. That's really him. Yeah. When you see certain people talk, certain people in the public eye, you don't know who they are. You have no idea who they are. It's very difficult to know. You see them in conversations. They have these pre-planned answers. They say everything. It's very rehearsed. You never get to the meat of it. What the, one of the beautiful things about you is that you free ball. Like you get out and you do these huge events, and you're just talking and you're making. We, we've we've highlighted you on the show many times for you when you did this Biden impression where he's walking around, he doesn't know what he's doing. It's, it's funny. It's it's stand up. <laughs> it's funny stuff. But uh. it's like you uh, and you were making fun of Elon one time. <laughs> you were doing an Elon impression. It's great. You you have like comedic instincts. Like when you said to Hillary, you'd be in jail. Like that's it's great timing. Yeah. But it's like that kind of stuff was unheard of as a politician. Like, no one had done that. And I think... You know, it's funny. You need at least the attitude of a comedian when you're doing this business. This is a very yes. dangerous business, first of all. It's a very tough business when... It's the most dangerous yeah, business. Yeah, it's the most... Well, for, for a job? Yes. I mean, I mean other than going to war and being a firefighter or being a cop... Yeah. It's the most dangerous it's business. It's the most dangerous. For being president is the most dangerous. Especially you. I mean, oh, we, much we, more you so. haven't even got to the election. There's been two assassination attempts. And they've yeah. brushed those out of the news like it was nothing. Yeah, they'd rather not talk about them. If you take a look at what's happened, look, I'm for having countries pay us billions and billions and trillions even dollars. I took in hundreds of billions of dollars from China. Nobody took in 10 cents, not one other president. I do things that make it, I mean, that don't necessarily make me so popular. I just do what's right. And when you do that, you know, you're more, look at, look at Iran. Iran. We would have never had the attack on Israel at all. Iran was broke. I told China, if you buy, you can't do business in the United States under any circumstances. I was going to, we we're going to go cold turkey with China. Some people think that would have been a good idea anyway. But if you buy any oil, one barrel of oil from them, you're not doing business. And I said that to many countries. Iran was broke. They had no money for Hezbollah. They had no money for Hamas. They had no money. But... I make myself, you know, I mean, I understand what I'm doing. It, it, you make yourself a target, and it's a very dangerous business. But if you just look at statistically, so I, I said, I sort of think, I don't know if it's right, but one-tenth of one percent for a race car driver. Yeah, it's a pretty dangerous business, right? Yeah. Uh, one to the paper. He's a consequential. He was the greatest president, blah, blah, blah. Then all of a sudden she goes in the view. She starts hitting the hell out of me. Because they won't hire unless... I've had many people go on CNN and they call and said, I don't know what to do. What? They want to pay me a lot, but I have to be negative on you. I said, be negative. That's okay. There are guys on like CNN. They won't hire them. Sean Duffy is a you know congressman and he retired. He got a good job with CNN, but he was only positive about Trump. So they kept him, but they would never put him on. I mean, I respect what he did. He could have gone you know, negative. I tell people... Go negative. You know, let my friends make the money. Well, it's, it's just, so crooked. The press it is, is crooked. so crooked. It's crooked, but it's also they're diminishing themselves. They're, they they're they themselves. are they're killing all their credibility, and it's opening up the credibility to new media. It's opening what, up the credibility to independent media. All these the worst I've ever seen though, and I've seen the worst. I mean, I've I've been a part of it. I've been I've seen the worst.